was a completely new world for me. My first test drive was as a child with an electric car, um, then remote control electric cars, but only uh, a test drive with a Zoe, a Nissan Leaf and a Tesla. Um, these were my test drives, but just for half an hour, one hour. This one was immediately the biggest tour, the biggest challenge with no experience. In winter, and under all risk um, conditions you could, could have. What we, what we have on, collected on GPS is 26,800 kilometers and we have the goal of 24,000 kilometers so we make more kilometers to be sure if everything is validated correctly. We have like 112 driving days. It's nice to mention to have 400 kilometers at, at one day. We were not doing every day 400, but um, we even made 400 kilometers in Romania. I used the Renault Zoe ZE40. It was the best available car in this um, range in this time. So um, in terms of autonomy, if you do a, a long distance trip, the most critical part is charging. Charging after you, you emptied the battery. So it's, it's just a matter of time. I wanted to finish this, this tour less than, than one year. If you do it somehow different, you can go with cars just 100 km, but then you, you need years to do something. So in terms of time, money and all parameters you have, it was was my choice to take a Zoe. It was like an uh, international project. A French car, a German driver, Romanian sponsor, Romanian students, um, IT specialist. It was uh, really nice, um, teamwork. It was very nice to do it in Romania because it was not obvious that this was possible. The record was made in Romania, not in Germany. And somehow I'm very proud. Um, to have made it in Romania because I, now I have a lot of friends and I'm even invited to a, to a wedding next year in Constanza. To show that electric mobility is practicable um, of doing it, to go with the car everywhere in the country, Restart has um, a franchise concept franchise concept that you can sell and buy electricity on their platform. Their platform is called RED and um, like I was showing that the car can go everywhere, of course this philosophy we, we, we are showing that this business model can be done everywhere in the country. And this platform allows consumers um, to be prosumers. You can change your contract, this is the first step. And then you have more options and look, wait for it. Restart will come up with, with new products and new, new concepts. There is a lot of in the pipe what will come in the future. It's an opportunity for, for sustainable energy producers to, to sell their electricity to this platform. And what is behind the idea is to free the energy market. This is always a, the question. Um, we consume energy, where is the energy coming from and who is um, producing it? Now we are in the time, in the era of internet and we have this nice tool of blockchain and of, of um, cryptocurrencies to operate this tool, to make it on, on, a, on a computer. Because back in time it was also maybe possible but with a lot of paperwork. Now, as we have computers, we are um, so fast um, and I really like innovations. I charged at the whole variety of possible charging stations. The minimum was a normal socket, 220 volts at, at the hotel or a private house. The car was charging in um, factory buildings. It was um, charging at wineries, so everybody who has a problem and travels in Romania, when there is a winery, if you're friendly and ask, maybe they help you with Trifasic. And when there was a public charging station, of course I used these public charging stations in big cities. They're very interested and if you show how easy it is, so you, you, you bring them in contact and explain. Then you, you take away fear because peop when people don't have knowledge, 
they don't know and they will rather not accept and not use. But this is what, what was our goal and what is my goal to show when it's possible in Romania, everywhere in the country, so we can convince people to, to get in contact, to make a test drive. After a test drive, then for sure, to sing in the future, to use an electric car. Very quick to my mind comes the area Dobroja, Delta Dunari, the famous bridge from Sal Saligny. I really enjoyed the, the, the buildings and the famous castle in Sinaya, Pelish Castle. Did you know they have a hydro power station there? This, this would be nice to charge an electric car in, in Pelish Castle from, from hydro power. It was a trip to myself to understand me better. Because you're alone with yourself, what do you do? So you can think about so many things and about yourself. So the lesson is, I 100% can trust me. I know that for every situation I find a solution when, when it's called a problem. So proving this in a country, not knowing the language no autobahn. We were, we were opening doors where we didn't have the keys. So it was a very magical trip. It's really important to create a standard. So everybody has a smartphone, knows different cables and it's not matching with other ones. Let us learn from this and not make some mistakes to also have this problem and create a nice platform where this process of charging is easy. We know um, the paper from, from Xerox has DIN A4. It's, it's a standard all over the world. With the standard, it will be much quicker a success. Goethe said something. Um, if you have doubts, stay at home, because doubts kill a lot of nice ideas. But if you're dedicated and you go out, the universe will provide you with everything you need. You find the right people and one thing he didn't say, he didn't say when it's delivering, delivering time. Um, this tour was very, very hard, harder than expected. The streets were worse than I expected, so ex expectations are disappointing you. But I, I made it and I have to say Goethe was right, but he didn't say when it's delivering time, so this means just keep going until you reach your goal.